This is the last covered bridge on this loop of the Bucks County Covered Bridges Tour. And the rain has begun to pick up here on this foggy, oh, and I mean foggy, the dense atmosphere here in the outskirts of Pennsylvania. So one thing you'll notice about these covered bridges, this one has a sign outside of it. It has a clearance of 12 feet, but it also has a bigger incline to get to the bridge. You also notice that a lot of cars coming through this bridge. So this one compared to the other ones that we've experienced today has a lot of through traffic coming into uh, into the bridge. Another thing you're going to notice, I'm getting hungry, people. I can't help that. But one thing that I can help is letting you know that anytime you're going to cross a covered bridge like this, one thing that you have to do is you have to stop, I would say, maybe about maybe 30 or 40 feet right before it. And what you're going to do is you're going to see that the bridge since it takes traffic from both directions you're going to have to stop to see that uh, you're the only car that's going in it or you don't want to get stuck in there or be forced to joust another car that's coming into the bridge while you're trying to get out of it so that's just common courtesy if you're approaching the bridge you want to stop a little bit before the bridge uh, just to see if the way is clear for you so without further ado let's just continue oh also by the way if you're shooting also please make sure that there's no downed cables on the floor that are electrified if they are you could call the county you could even call the police and they can find someone to go ahead and fix it what else can i say um, if you're going to be shooting in the middle of the road which i don't recommend Either do it early enough where there's no one there or do it late enough where there's no one there. Also wear reflective clothing or just stand off to the side. You don't have to be in the middle of everything. But also get a spotter to watch you so you know that you know when a car is coming and when you are clear. I'm trying to do it fast. I don't just camp out out there waiting for a car to come or a truck to come. or Don't expect cars to notice you just because you're out there doing your art so have a wonderful day this has this has been the first loop of the pennsylvania covered bridges tour there's another loop that includes about seven more covered bridges but we'll do that at a later date we will get to it bye bye keep shooting